Steve from Got Game here. Uh, today we're doing hurdles and athletics. In hurdles, very, very important not to lose speed as we go over hurdles. Now, you can set up a hurdle if you've got one, okay, of course, pool noodles or anything around the house that we can jump over the top of can alternate, just make sure that it's safe. In hurdles, there's two parts to a hurdle, lead leg and trail leg. We also have to look at the important part that we learned in sprinting to keep our head nice and still, okay? The lead leg is simply like kicking the door down. So as we go past the hurdle, we're going in our, with our L-shaped arms and high knees. As we get to the hurdle, we're going to kick up our lead leg. And here you can see I'm practicing next to the hurdle, kicking the lead leg up as I go past. So when you see me go from here, I'm running through, I kick the leg up and practice my lead leg. My trail leg's much the same. Um, some people call it the dog going to the bathroom because our trail leg actually comes out to the side, around and over. Again, we don't want to rotate our body too much because we lose speed on the runway. So we need to keep our body straight on. Try not to let your head go up and down too much. So rather than a jump, it's actually just lifting our legs as we go over rather than jumping like some people think. With the trail leg again, okay, coming up to the hurdle, we go over with the trail leg, practicing. Okay, and then once we've got it all together, we can try the whole thing. Okay, coming through, we go over, trail leg over the top. We now focus on the different aspects of hurdling. The lead leg for the first run. The trial leg for the second run. And the combination for the third run.